In this video you will learn how to disable Windows updates, including the latest updates of Windows 10 and 11, where it is more difficult. We will discuss how to do this manually, as well as using a special program. If this video helps you, don't forget to write a comment and share it with your friends. Another kind of gratitude? Donate. Link in description. How to disable Windows updates. Many people want to do this when the systems use them and they don't want the update to break anything. In addition, updates can interfere or waste network resources that you need for other purposes. At the moment, five services are responsible for the Windows Update Center. WUAUSERV is an update center service. Earlier it was enough to disable it, but now there are other services that restore it. For example, VAS Medic Service, Windows Update Service resuscitation and countering users who try to disable updates. Do Service is a service designed to download Windows updates and applications from the Windows Store, not from one server, but from several at once. USO Service, a service that manages Windows update packages. When you try to stop or disable this service, Windows renames it to confuse the user. And Bits, a service that reserves network bandwidth for downloading Windows updates and also ensures that updates run in the background. If settings or explorer fail, updates continue to be downloaded and queued for installation. If you block these five services, Windows will not be able to update in any way. How to do it? The first easiest way is through the program. Download the latest version of the PCNP Assistant program, which I developed myself. Go to Services and Soft, Update tab, and either manually disable all toggles or click Disable Updates. After that, be sure to restart your computer and the updates will stop working. The same can be done manually. Type Reg Edit in Start or Search, run the registry editor as an administrator. Find services at this path. HK Local Machine System Current Control Set Services. The first service from the list, Bits. Click on the section, on the right find the Start parameter and enter 4. This will disable the auto start of the service. Then, in the same way, disable the other four services. After that, restart the computer and check the result. If you know something else useful about working with updates, share the information in the comments under this video. It will be very useful for everyone. See you there or in other videos on the PCNP channel.